Oren Hudson believes he can change the world. It's your move. With a chessboard and quick wit, he's convincing these kids to be someone. Now he is trying to keep one million students off the streets. It is a noble cause, and he is using chess to do just that. Oren C. Hudson is the founder of Be Someone. It is a nonprofit organization designed to help inspire a lot of kids through the game of chess. The veteran and former law enforcement officers already reached 55,000 children this week. He is leading the organization's annual summer camp at the Stone Mountain Training Center. Children make bad decisions when they don't have nothing positive to do. And so we're giving children a positive outlet to do during the summertime. We're teaching them how to use, put brains before bullets and to think it out, don't shoot it out. Yeah, we had him on our air in February or so Impressive. where he was talking Impressive about this. Yeah. The chess champion uses a life-size chess board to get the attention of the students. Hudson is the recipient of the FBI Director's Community Leader Award and a recent winner of DeKalb County's CEO's Hero Award. Good for him. Three words. Pull them up. That is the message from Oren Hudson the, uh, to the young man of North Texas. His idea is simple but pretty powerful. Hudson wants young men to pull up their pants, and he thinks that is step one in getting grades up and staying on track. Well, chess is considered a sport, right? But here in the state of Georgia, it's being used for far more. A former state police officer has developed a program to help young people be someone. And our Randy Kay reports one activity for achieving that goal involves a game of chess. Well, our next report comes from CNN's Randy Kay. It's about an organization in Atlanta, Georgia, that uses chess to help young people make life decisions. How can Rook to King's Pawn 4 apply to more than a board game? We're going to let Randy and the organization's founder explain. A Georgia man is inspiring inner-city students across the country through chess. It's teaching them to make the right moves in life. Our Randy Kay has the story in this What Matters segment. He's a former Alabama State Trooper, Air Force veteran, founder of Be Someone, and the recipient of the FBI Community Leader Award, Oren Hudson. I'd love to have your resume. Oren, thanks for being with us on Fox & Friends Weekend. You once played 50 people in chess. Yes, sir. And, one of, and beat all of them? Yes, sir. Wow. You're pretty good at chess. Well, I'm still learning. The attitude <laughs> that I have is that I don't know what I'm doing because once you know it all, you're no longer teachable. Birmingham chess champion is using the game strategy to influence the city's youth. Warren C. Hudson says he was once an at-risk teen growing up in Birmingham. Former Alabama State Trooper Oren Hudson is leading the program, which is being held at the Center for Cultural Arts in downtown Gadsden. Today, Orrin Hudson shares his time and his knowledge with many kids, but he says he owes his success to this man. And I taught him. He got better and better. I loved it. By the senior year, I was pushing it to keep up with him. James Edge, a now retired teacher, says Hudson listened and learned, an important trait in life. He was a great guy, and I was glad to teach him something. If that changed his life, great. I reached over 55,000 kids. My goal is a million, and I'm going to get there one child at a time. For Oren Hudson, this is more than just a game. It was the key to changing his life. I'm living my dream because a teacher took the time to, to show me a game and taught me the power of thinking ahead. As a teenager, Hudson often found himself getting into trouble until one day a teacher handed him a book. The turning point in my life is when he taught me chess, I started making better grades because people thought I was smart because I was playing chess. Since then, everything changed for the better in Hudson's life. One, two, turn. You could do it now. One, two, turn. You could do this. Bad things happen when good people fail to take action. Well, a crime prevention program hits Baltimore today in hopes of stopping the violence in the city. Brains before bullets. We're going to get to the bottom of that and see what that's all about. Coming up next on Good Day Saturday. Now pay attention to what I do, Clay, because whatever I do, you can do. Say nature. Nature. It's neutral. It's neutral. neutral. 
So which, which one? Okay. Go to? Step up. I'll go to Step up. Step up. Get my math class. Time. Check. One man is traveling the country trying to keep more kids out of trouble using a very unique method to make it happen. A former gang member is going to use a life-size chessboard to encourage students to have a successful school year. Step up. Step up. Children, get your head in the game. Check. It's a game of skill and strategy. You have everything you need to win. My name is Orrin C. Hudson. I started Be Someone, Inc. because seven people shot on a robbery in Queens, New York. And I said to myself, bad things happen when good people fail to take action. So I'm taking action, teaching young people how to cash in. K for knowledge, A for attitude, S for skills, and H for habits. I am. I am. Somebody. Somebody. My mind. Mine. Is a pearl. It's a pearl. I can, I can change the world. The world. I came up with the name Be Someone because Abraham Lincoln, his mother, her last words on the planet to Abraham Lincoln was Be Someone. And even though he had failed eight times running for public office, Abraham Lincoln took those two words, Be Someone, all the way to the White House. My assignment is to empower our young people to pull their pants up, their head up, and their grades up, and to put brains before bullets. Think it out, don't shoot it out. And the teen empowerment workshop is using a giant chessboard to help students make smarter choices and avoid gun violence. To put brains before bullets. The only way to fight is to use your head. Be someone.org. It's, it's, it's integrity. And we got to teach children there's no lies on the board. It's true. If you're true to yourself and you're true to others, you win every time. Integrity is the magic word. I owe my life to a teacher who bought me a chess book and told me that all readers are leaders. He taught me six magic words. Take time to think things through.